What's up guys, Chris here from Mainly Mesh. It's Mainly Monday, so we're definitely gonna have a giveaway giving you a run up of what's actually going to happen this week, I swear, because next week, basically this Friday, from the 3rd to 11th, to the 11th of March, uh, I'm gonna be going on vacation, and I don't care. So, no orders are gonna be going out, the shop's gonna be closed. I will send you guys follow-up emails uh, during that break, just reminding you if you do place an order that the order will not be going out until the 12th, I believe, although I think the 12th is a Sunday. So the 13th, March 13th, uh, all the orders will be going out. Sorry about that, but I'm really not that sorry because I'm gonna take a little break and then we're gonna be on our grind for the season. Awesome weekend of college across. If you didn't catch all the games, uh, at least look back at the scores. You can catch some replays on uh, the ESPN app as well. I was trying not to jinx myself on Twitter, follow me on Twitter at Mainly Mesh, by calling that Army was going to beat Syracuse because I was calling that in the shop constantly and then Army hit the post to not send it into overtime against Cuse. So Cuse pulled away a 9-8 win, but huge win for Army. Uh, Boston University, shout out to my man Isaac. They just got ranked uh, number 20th by the IO Gear poll. So it's a Interesting year in that I don't think there's too many like top top tier teams out there But that's cool because a lot of these kind of non-traditional schools are coming in and you know Might be able to make a push down the road. So that's gonna be really interesting. Make sure you guys are tuning into the field game uh, Let's see what else uh, just an overview today. I'm going to be getting up a more in-depth overview of the mark one uh, I've been struggling to keep the Under Armour commands in stock, so I will maybe do a, a review of that this week, but you guys are already buying too many too quickly. Can't complain about that, I guess. So the UA commands are in stock. I'm waiting on a restock of the Nike CEOs. We have a bunch of Lakota U's in stock, so check those out. Mark 1's are obviously a plenty. Going to be throwing up the A7150 on the website today or tomorrow, as well as the String King Complete. And some epic lacrosse apparel, which should be really cool. I'm just looking around the store, seeing what else I've missed. Also, keep an eye out for some headstrong lacrosse giveaways. Not giveaways, but fundraisers, I should say, coming up once I return after this break. So there won't be any mainly Monday or Winter Wednesday next week. So I think that's about as much as I can bore you guys with before you guys stop watching the video. So I'm going to dig into the freebie box, freebie box this week. So let's say, okay, here's a good idea. So because of this week's release of Throne Fiber, which is a really cool new mesh offering from Throne lacrosse, uh, really pumped to see Joe getting back into the game a little bit with some new mesh offerings, kind of putting himself back in that nice performance mesh tier. So I had to take a little pause because I had a better idea for the giveaway this week. Thanks to, thanks to, it makes no sense. Because of this week's release of Throne Fiber, make sure you check that out at mainlymesh.com. So Throne Fiber released this week, I'll be putting up my review today as well. So comes in this awesome packaging that's now on the ground but uh gonna be giving away a full kit of throne fiber stuff so we've got a white piece of mesh black strings and the black shooters with the white uh heavy top shooter pretty pumped about it just excited to see throne getting back into kind of the the regular uh tier of performance mesh it's an interesting offering for sure and the ruby and the cobalt AKA the red and the blue colors look awesome. Uh, the gold aglets are killer, obviously. Just awesome seeing him getting back into the into the game a little bit there. So gonna be giving away that full kit. Also gonna be giving away one of these awesome throne bracelets that has, and if you couldn't tell from the dizzying video on Instagram. So it's really cool, it has a uh, Throne on the outside with their T logo and then on the inside uh, This is gonna be backwards since I flipped it. Oh if I just turn it upside down then it won't be it says gold standard on the inside Which is really cool gonna be giving away that as well as a Tank top because it's almost summer. It's 60 degrees in Maine today in February So don't tell me climate change isn't a thing 
Hey, what's going on, Throne Army tank top? I love this tank top, but I'm gonna part ways with it and give it to one of you guys. So, I believe it's a size large. So, in order to win this kit, all you gotta do is in the comments down below, in the comments down below, tell me who you think the biggest D1 surprise this year has been. Is it Hofstra, Townsend, Towson? Uh, is it Boston University, Army? There's been some really surprising teams coming out of nowhere this year, even Navy, although they just lost uh, to BU in overtime. It's been a crazy year uh, seeing so many Patriot League teams come up out of nowhere. Uh, some other some other new name teams as well. So let me know down below who you think the biggest surprise of this year's D1 field season is going on into the rest of the season. I think that's about it. Thanks so much. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. I'll be giving this away this Winter Wednesday. I'll catch you guys next time.